Kelvin with Chumba USA. I'm here today to kind of talk to you guys a little bit about our new uh, mid-fat bike here. It's called the Ursa Backcountry. Uh, it's a 100% made in USA bike. We use USA True Temper Steel tubing as well as 4130 Chromali. We use uh, stainless steel dropout hardware from Paragon Machine Works. And uh, it's an excellent trail riding bike. It comes in a single speed format, uh, trail XT format, and then also a backcountry edition, which is what you see here. The backcountry model comes complete with a custom made frame bag from Wanderlust Gear, They're made out of Virginia. And uh, each, size, each size frame comes specifically with a bag that's made to fit inside of that space. Uh, we make sure to leave a little bit of room here so that you can also still get in and adjust the front derailleur, give some clearance if it gets really muddy on you really out on the tour. The, the rest of the bags here are also made by Wanderlust here in the in, uh, USA. Uh, are available in our web store. Uh, you can find those online. So we have a, a, a saddle bag, top tube gas tank, and a handlebar roll top bag. Uh, great for storing things through here. Open closures on both sides. Lots of room to work with there. Uh, one thing that's really unique about our bike too is that we have a really well thought out and time tested through many variations of prototypes, a uh, clean chain line. And you'll see here we have massive amount huge amount of chain clearance between the tire and the chain. And we do that by kind of incorporating a little bit of our heritage of our company, which is actually based in downhill. So we use downhill standards from the mountain biking industry uh, to create a better chain line that's going to result in a better trail riding bike without any chain suck. And uh, we've had a lot of testing done on this bike. Our gentleman here, Joey Parent, uh, you can find a lot of information about him. Uh, just did a uh, 550 mile tour of Iceland, came back after all that, took a week off, and uh, won his category in the Trans North Georgia race on this bike. Over two and a half days of riding, over 50,000 feet of climbing. So it's a pretty proven platform with both racing trail and single speed. Hope you guys check it out and enjoy it. Thanks so much.